Uh, what's up everybody cash here so doing something a little bit different um we have this uupl game between uh shiba uh one of my good friends old friend from a <laughs> long time ago versus gondra um i'm gonna try to get alive in here because uh, i think this is his team playing so let me uh message him on discord um all right, let's see if I can get him in the chat. Uh, let me join in the chat. All right, so um, we got Sheba brought like kind of a more offensive team. Um, Dual steals, All right? Hydra is probably scarf. Um, right here, that's kind of cool. It's not something you really see very much. Uh, just looks like it's rock on this team, but maybe it's like rocks SD. I'm not really sure. Uh, so, Gligar just earthquakes off the rip. I mean, Gondra brought fat. Like, uh, I'm a little out of practice in UU, but uh. The Krasma's not very common, so it's kind of cool. Maybe, like, combined, um, you know, double fat pink stuff. Uh, Magneton, um, decent. I mean, obviously, you can't trap Lucario, so we'll just get blown back by CC or Focus Blast. But, and it can't even, I don't think, I don't know if Ghost can get trapped. I don't think they can. Maybe I'm just dumb. I don't really remember. I haven't played Standard Tears in so long. Um, yeah, hey, I think... can you hear me? Oh, yeah, what's up? Hey. I'm much excited, man. Yeah, Gondra's on your team, right? Yeah, yep. Cool. So, um, this is a live. Um, you can say hi. Hey, everyone. Um, so, he's actually... In this tour, he's on Gondra's team. What's your team name? The Ruin Valley Rangers. All right. And so this is the finals. Is this the first game of it? Has anyone played yet? Yeah, this is the first one. Word. So. And I think they are best of three. So all three, um, Gen 7, 6, and 5. Oh, really? So they're about to play best of three right now? Oh, no. Sorry. No, I'm wrong. They, it, Gondra's just SN. Gotcha. So Gondra brought some fat. I was talking about this before. Gondra brought some fat stuff. Uh, Shiba actually brought some like more off, like bulk, bulky offense, um, which I like like a little bit better. Yeah. Uh, the B B is really good. Um, I mean, strong like really strong U turn. I think it's like one forty attack or one fifty attack. Yeah. And it can set T-spikes. So I don't know. Um, I think this is Bug Z Necrozma. Oh, really? Like Signal Beam? Or, no, no. That's a different team. Yeah, it's it's um, it has Signal Beam, but it's Psychic and Z. Oh, um, cool. So that's really going to be like the main thing, is he needs to keep Gliger... Um, so B doesn't set spikes or can't keep spikes on. I mean, you were mentioning something about Dublade. Um, in the chat, they're saying that Dublade can't get trapped. I didn't know that mechanic. Yeah, can, the, so when you're ghost type, you can't get trapped. Oh, cool. Um, Dublade is decent in this game. Uh, it might. So basically, he has Shiba has a bunch of stuff that's walled by Gliger. Yeah. Um, yeah. This is kind of like an interesting Gliger set. It looks like it's no U-turn. Or, yeah, cause it's definitely Roost. Um, so it looks like it's no yeah. U-turn. Damn. Because I, I, I thought it was gonna have, he was going to have some Volt turn on this. Maybe like... I don't know if Cobalion might be Volt switch. I'm not sure. Mm, yeah. It... Cobalion is Volt switch. Um... And Magneton as well. 
Yeah, so um, I figured. I really, I really wanted to get a rocks against this B drill. I think like that's the the big thing. I think even like, well, I don't know what this Lucario is. If it's, I mean, it could be special or physical, you know. Um, special, special. Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, I, th- <clears throat> I feel like it might be special. I feel like Nasty Plot's pretty good. Yeah. I don't know what has rocks on Gondra's team. I mean, it could be this Blissey, but it could be Cabalion. Because it's definitely mm-hmm. not Glagger, yeah. so... Ah, uh, this is this is not good for Gondra here. This is a freebie U-turn. Yeah. And he's not going to have, like, a ton to take this, because... He probably doesn't want Glagger to take it. Yeah. I don't know. This is gonna this is probably gonna be a, a relatively oh he's Rocky Helmet, that's good. Okay. So he's probably just yeah. rocks on this then. Yeah, and let well Yeah, I guess it's it's like a... because that that hydra's gonna be defog. Yeah. Um so I guess that's like the the first goal is like to get rid of the defog and then you can then B will die to rocks yeah, I don't know if, um, but it's like that's when they usually just run like Draco and Dark Pulse and like uh, well if it's if it's Scarf it might run a fire move but if it's not it might be just uh, Roost Defog yeah. and maybe like a Z or something yeah I'm not um, sure if it, it looks like it might be Scarf on this team, but... It would make, it would make a lot of sense to me with the rest of his team. Yeah. He's got possible, like, double priority. Like, I I don't know if Shiba follows the yeah. same. Like, when I used I used to play UU a lot, and sometimes I, I would just not... I'd run no Scarf if I had a lot of priority on my team, because I, I felt like that could make oh, up yeah. for it. But I don't think Shiba would bring something like that to this. <laughs> I doubt it. He could also be some like fire scarf Lucario thing, but I, I doubt that too. But it's a possibility. Yeah. Uh, Shiba named this mon after you. How does it feel? I don't know. I don't. I think I turned what? His uh, his de blade is named alive. Oh, I think I have like them all turned off. Oh, you have nicknames so, off. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying nah, to. I just fix that. I'm gonna put it back on. Yeah, I play. I like the name. Only turn them off if they get out of hand. But these are some pretty good ones. Oh, these song names. Yeah. yeah Pursue this... the packing thing. Well, I know those two, so yeah, that's what it is. Uh, let's see, go here. I mean, so uh, I'm assuming Sheba's trying. Yeah, this a few U turns here. He's got two options. He could go right here and try to throw his rocks down, but he'll probably get toxic if he it does that. I don't know. Like the the beach was really good because I mean the the Colba switch is there, but if he drill runs, that Colba still takes a bunch. Yeah. Um, and so it's really tough. I don't know. It would be Glider can like safely get in once more, like right here. I mean, well, on the drill room, of course, but even on the U-turn, he can safely get in. But it's just, you have to find the room to roost. Yeah, he's you probably like, gonna, he's gonna roost here, I think. Yeah. The other thing is, like, if, if the Glider gets knocked by the uh, Beedrill, which I'm assuming it's got, unless it's T-Spike's roost as the last two for the Beedrill, I, I'm pretty sure drill runs knock, though. And that would be, I mean, you know, yeah. losing EV light is you know, it's pretty awful. Oh, he's going for the flinch here. Curse, that's an interesting play. But at the same time, when you do have it, you know, it's pretty great. I don't know what this, this doesn't have. I don't, I don't really know. I, I guess he was expecting the U-turn to come in there. But this is bad yeah. for Gondra now because he's already shown he's mono attack earthquake. So he can't yeah. actually hit this. Yeah. 
So he's U turn dark pulls. I wish he had, yeah, Draco. I wish he had something to hit the um drill switch in. The B drill switch in because otherwise I think just like by numbers do uh she was gonna get something off on Gondra if he keeps getting his B drill in. Yeah. So right now Gliger's at sixty, so <sighs> if Sheba can pressure it. He won't be able to get his roost off. Like, right here, if he doubles. Oh, he didn't double. I mean... He might just stay in and attack it here. I don't, I don't really sure. Knock on Glagger would have been great in this in this match instead of Curse, but... I yeah. don't know. Curse is interesting. I, I haven't actually seen that that much. I, I mean... Yeah. It looks like this is... Kind of his... Because, so, say he fights, like, Superpower Scizor. Uh, he doesn't have really much for that. <laughs> Yeah. Right, like if it's SD superpower scissor, what does Gondra's team do versus that? Just get I think, obliterated. I think you just you <laughs> either get in on this S D or just um something sacks and then uh, Magneton does it. Yeah. It's a tough matchup. So he's, he's probably got Geiger for um for a good uh curse for a scissor yeah. um You know, scissor switch in because I've seen, yeah, I some... mean, the bill. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> no, I was gonna say, I've seen some people like have Gliger as their scissor answer, but they don't have curse, and then the, the scissor just SDs in their face 20 times while they roost and then kills yeah. them anyway. Yeah, the um, Gondra running the two psychics here, and those are, I mean, those are his two late game ones. The it's it'll be, I think they're both will be calm mind. Um, the Necrozma and uh, Slowbro. Yeah, it's kind of kind of bad. You know, you got the Hydreigon and then Beedrill and Dewblade. You know, Dewblade sets up. He he can just kind of walk through. Let's see how much it did? Thirty four. See this this is scary here because so say he earthquakes and he like shadow claws. Oh, let me close my door. Freaking loud outside. I live on like a college yeah, campus. Yeah, yeah. Like a college campus, so people like walk around and talk about stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, like, close my... It gets hot in my room. From the doors. All right. I guess the one like positive thing for Gondor is he does have recovery on his team, and he does have you know ways to to move around. Volt switch on the tube seals. Uh, you know, regenerator the roost soft boiled. But he has to start getting hits on Shiva's team. Yeah. Uh, the the damage on the duo is great. Uh, you know, so far. But. Yeah, it's pretty good. <clears throat> yeah, I, I Gunner's Gunner has uh, actually a pretty decent matchup here because um, he has a bunch of like fat stuff versus mm -hmm. a more a little bit more of an offensive team. Um, mm -hmm. especially if this Hydreigon Scarf, right? Because then it can't roost. So it's taking Chip to defog. And then, you know, once it dies, Beedrill's getting crushed by rocks. <sighs> yeah. So interesting team by Shiba. Yeah. I wonder, I, I, I mean, unless it doesn't have T-Spikes, I wouldn't imagine you'd pick Beedrill without it. I guess you can. Um, but I really thought he would have, like, T-spiked there, or, like, at least at some point in this match, just to make, uh, Gondra, like, have to bring in the Gliger. Oh, so he has, he has nice, but, uh, this could be... It's not, yeah, it's not great. Um, I don't know what... <clears throat> he could be Dark Pulse. If it's, I don't know if it's fighting Z, I don't know if that like does too much to the Blissey. I don't know. I'm. I wonder how fast his Cabalion is. Mm. Uh, well, I I'm thinking this. Well, he might not even have. He probably has Vacuum Wave. Yeah. Yeah, he's but... definitely got Vacuum Wave. He probably has Focus Blast fighting on Z. Um. It's basically just what's his other move. 
Could be Dark mm -hmm. Pulse. I think Dark Pulse is pretty common for like the blade, but man, she was getting is he getting some low timers out here? Oh yeah! Wow. Yeah, he wasn't even looking. But awesome. Oh, oh crazy! Whoa. Crazy. Oh, that's pretty. Wow. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I don't know what um, this will do. Like that's that's a really like, that's a really strong fighting. Z. I don't know if Lissy takes it. Yeah, he got punished too. Well, he got the burn on him, so he can he can try to some switch shenanigans, but something's probably dying. Oh, this is this is uh, all right. Here we go. Absolutely oh, gone. it's corpse. Cool. Oh, it's just flash right, again. Well, okay. <laughs> he probably know. actually can't really hurt the slow bro then. Yeah, I I wonder if you just pick him off. Well, no, he doesn't have a dinner anymore. Um, wow, that did a lot. He's probably gonna. Oh wow, he actually yeah, went for you that. You just pick him off and try to roost up later. I guess you can roost on a scarf, uh, defog, or sorry, you you know, soft uh, slack off on a yeah. scarf to defog, or just in right here your space. Yeah, that that was a good trade for Gondra because Magneton wasn't. Wasn't like it, was, it wasn't, yeah. And I mean, that's who you would use it on anyway, right? Yeah. You know, if anything. So you can't really. I mean, unless it might have been. Maybe that's. You know, scarf. maybe you would have like. It would, yeah, it was scarf magneton. So maybe yeah. like you just. If they have a low do blade and they don't kill with uh, like a boosted shadow sneak, you just kind of force a trade there. But that was that was as good of a trade as you're gonna get. They might trade rocks here. Um, I don't know if I'm Shiba here. I'm attacking because I don't, I don't want to give rocks for free. Uh, yeah. But he might trade him. I mean, there's no really point. I don't know what Gondra's gonna do. He he could, he could rocks. He could just go he, Gligar. That's he pretty might safe. Just go Gligar. I mean, and, and to get that health back is really oh, nice. Yes, oh, yes, he's taunt. That's pretty good. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> you would have won. Yeah, I see. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm an earthquake in there 100% of the time. Yeah. Well, now this is pretty good for Gondor. Yeah, that was uh, some pretty not great momentum plays. Mm. Oh, no. Okay, well, uh, I don't know. I don't know how much that does. Like, I didn't calc anything really on if that's specs because I, I really like specs primer yeah he might be, um, specs moonblast yeah. probably killing this yeah uh, so he's probably just gonna go blissy nope. yeah he's gonna try to double on it mm -hmm, that makes sense but again i mean this is like how much is b drill doing if he's not gonna get two spikes down for whatever reason yeah this is gonna be this is looking rough for shiva I mean, it's not it's not like unwinnable yet. Oh, it's poison jab instead of knock. Yeah, I, I figured it was. I f thought it would probably be poison. All right, so he's roosting here. Yeah, then that, yeah, that makes a lot of sense because well, there's if you want to deal with um, well, he's got a couple ways to deal with like alt. Um, that makes sense. I know um, Pack, who's on the team, has been when he's built some. B drill and in some other tiers, he's, he likes knockoff. Yeah, knockoff B drill is pretty good. Um, this is pretty pretty safe for Gondra. I mean, she was probably doubling here. Yeah, that's what I figured. That was a, that was a good call by Gondra. Yeah, no leftovers. Yeah, no leftovers. I actually really like uh, Metronome Primarina. I. I Oh yeah, I, mm -hmm. I doubt he has that, but I think that there's some like uh, I guess controversy of whether that's actually good or not. But mm -hmm. I've had some decent luck with it. Uh, yeah, this is looking real bad for Shiba actually. How does he? Okay, that was a good... he's gonna get to make big no switches. The thing about the all these double switches is because he has the Gliger and the Blissey, it's really not that bad. It's like okay, well you, you made the right choice, but I just switch. Yeah, I wonder what he was expecting right there. I don't know. I mean, Shiva might just go for this and and try to like. 
Okay. I'm really doing it wrong. Well. I thought Shiva might just SD right there. Um, so I feel like he's kind of in the back a little bit right now. Yeah, well, he now he's maneuvered into a nice little spot. Um, you probably just... This Blissey, I don't think it has um, a way to hit the Dubloid. Yeah, definitely not. Like no, like no flamethrower or anything like that. It would be. Um, okay, this is my. Uh, this is, you can keep going. Um, I wonder if he's gonna throw rocks. Yeah, he did. Just gonna force a defog here. He'll probably just go. Oh, he went Hydra. I'm surprised actually. I guess it's a little bit safer. Yeah, I mean it's 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 like really tough for Sheila. Like, what do you? What can you do? In this. Um, Oh. He's full here. Uh huh. He went for the rocks play. But again, it's like once you have the hundred percent glider, you know, you you kind of okay with just doing these. Yeah, she was basically gonna need to like try to SD and crit the crit the glider with shadow claw. Yeah. Oh yikes! That's really bad for him. <laughs> it's not the crit one. Yeah, this is this is looking over. I don't know how he. Uh, I mean, he could just go Hydra here and defog. But it doesn't help him at all because he's just gonna go straight back into Cabalion. Yeah. I'm also not sure if, like, I mean, it. Well, he wouldn't run trade the blogger, but I was thinking, like, even if you just got damage on him and then had to switch him out in fear of like a shadow sneak or something. Um. Oh, that's an interesting one. Um, like, I, I think the Koba just picks off the Dublade then. Yeah. This is looking real bad. The other thing, well, he's got to he's got to get around this Hydreigon, which isn't too bad. Um, but once he does, like, he just clicks, you know, Psychic through this whole team. Well, except, I mean, he switches out of B-Drill and just clicks Psychic through the rest of them. Yeah. I think, I think, I think you just, you hit enough on the Dubois. I think it kills. Wow, I'm surprised he went for rocks, but. Pretty, it's pretty good situation here but for me. Yeah, this is looking this is looking good for Gondra because she was pressured to, pressured to defog, but it's tough for him to defog without not give up a bunch of free turns. Um, if this is, I don't know what what this runs exactly, is but it? oh, stored power. Like he's no. Tr I mean, I don't even know. Like, what is how much? Yeah, it's not that tanky. Um, but I just didn't know what like, Prison Armor did for him. I would be surprised to take a B. You'd, probably not. Oh, uh, yeah, he definitely does. I mean, you, just have, you just have the Glider anyway. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you always go Glider here because you don't want to let Shiba back in. So, I mean. Oh, Ooh, that's what it is. But still, oh, that did nothing. What the hell? Yeah. This, I mean, this... for what it is, it did nothing, you know. Huh. Zamrock. <laughs> yeah, this is over. He just... He's only, he's only be one more time. He's got to go Hydra and defog here. It's kind of a free defog. Well, it's actually... This is actually really bad. Cause, so, he's just going to curse here. Yeah, the... the... No the, reason the, not to just curse. Hydra doesn't really do anything to him. He's reveal surf. Oh, uh, he just straight attacked. I guess he had to make that play. He doesn't really have any other choices. Because if he defogs there and Gliger curses, uh, yeah, she was sacking something. <laughs> Something's yeah. dying. As toss. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think this is this is probably over. Softball. All right. Oh boy, here we okay. go. Okay. Well, I mean, that's still so slow. So I mean, deep do does right here even out? You know, does he beat the uh, Gliger? I don't know. Probably not. Say that. Oof. I mean, um, his only play, his only play is this SD again. I, I don't see. It. There's no way you win if you do anything else but that. Yeah, that's interesting though. Huh. Wow, he didn't. Oh, do that. oh, that. Oh, that does nothing. Yeah, he needed to SD again. Because mm. now he's now he's in a really bad spot. Oh, that's, that was a good call. Yeah, that's a good. I mean, I, I guess Sheba's thought process is if I can get this Gligar low enough or I can somehow pick it off with Beedrill, he'll, he can win. No, but I guess, I mean, in the very, well, it'd be hard to maybe in like the, like a very long term strategy, you run him out of roof. I don't know if that's even feasible, but oh, you gotta do something. Because Mega Pro is probably uh, Mega Pro be at thirty one. Mega Pro would just die to poison jab from that range. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't do that much. Or it doesn't. Uh, Focus is going for this. He's going for the flinch. I don't. What are these other moves? I'm assuming this is like what toxic. Mm, well, uh, probably defog and probably Draco, right? No, on the on the blissey. On the blissey. Oh, that's um. Oh well. Maybe he might be wish protect. That's a decent set. Wow, that actually did kind of a lot. Definitely specs. Yeah. If only he was uh, I a mean, like echo voice. Just one right here. Mm. <laughs> I mean, so... Gondra can play this pretty safely and just switch around, I think. If I'm Sheba, I, the only way I see winning, if I'm Sheba, is I'm going to just straight up start SDing with Rhyperior and just try to trade it for three quarters of Gligar's health. Yeah. Oh, he's not doing it. Well, no, no, you can't. Really. Yeah, you gotta roost. Here, I mean, if that's a roost hide, then he buys himself like a lot more time to kind of get something work, get something to work. Yeah, how much was Dark Wolves um, doing to this? It was like it's like thirty, thirty-five, right? Yeah, so he's not gonna risk it flinched right there all right so he got the defog off um that's pretty good but something's about to get blasted here he's going to arrive he can wow. come in but yeah he got the second toss to just get some oh, that's and crazy. we know like only like u-turn does 50 and so he just moves you know, he just soft worlds or he just switches i guess oh that was an idea i'm surprised he didn't just go right here on that turn into the blissey yeah. Yeah, this is looking looking bad. Well, I mean, how much? Yeah, nine soft boiled, eight roosts. It's not. I mean, impossible. No, it's definitely not impossible. He's, he's got more attacks than Gondor has heals, but you know, it's like. Like this, uh, you know, what do you do? Uh, like, you got a P jab here. Do you, you think you go for a crit? Well, I, you just poison jab because it, it doesn't hit Cabalion. Because um, if he goes Cabalion and you U turn, the game's over. I think. He, I don't oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Like, so if, if Shiba cooks U turn, oh, wow, he got the pursuit on it. That's pretty good. Um, 
Yeah, yeah. But that doesn't really help him. <laughs> Just earthquake here for free. Yep. Yeah. And that's that's really tough. Wow. It's funny, he's just sacking his sweepers because he doesn't need them. Man. I'm so actually kind but, of surprised it did 43, but. Yeah. Um, yeah, he doesn't really. Slowbro is pretty Yeah, I would have liked to see it. See them saved. I mean, it would have been. I mean, it would have been more. Um, I don't know. Like, from my peace of mind to see us have our big sweepers and, and like, let Game Mon still alive, but it's still not too bad right here. So. Conjure's got a few options here. Um, he could... Yeah. Mm. I was going to say, so he, he could rocks and just try to trade his Cavalion for the Beedrill. Mm. Probably. That would have been an interesting, like, stay in from Shiba to just click it again. Because, I mean... I probably... I don't would've. know... What? I don't know if, like, close combat kills that. I mean, it's... Well, 20 minute probably. Um... Depending on how much HP you got. I mean, I'm clicking close combat again here. I think. I wouldn't risk it. I think you just you just have the blissy switch and so you just do it. Cause even if like you trade damage on the Rhyperior, then Koba can come back in. And like if Rhyperior somehow wins out over the Gliger, I'm sure Gliger's still getting some damage off. And yeah. Then you send Kobe back in. What do you yeah. think? I was, yeah, I see what you're saying. It's a little bit safer the way you do it. Well, I was just kind of CC again there because, so he's only got, I mean, I'm a, under the assumption he has Draco on this. Yeah, yeah, probably uh, most likely. I mean, there's like a, the chance of a fire blast, right? But it's not super likely. Pop Shiba. You, hmm. That's actually kind of a crazy play. Hmm. How much is this gonna do? Yeah, the the oh. fact that it's not like skill link is kind of scary for uh, Andrew. Or, or no, that it's scary for Shiba. It's like if you only get your twenty off, that's not. He actually put himself yeah. in a decent spot here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Could if wow, he switched that, that did fifty. What the heck? Nah, yeah, it's he's, he's only got he's only got four pumps left though. Yeah. And you know, obviously, pump can miss, which would. That's a little, yeah, it's a little risky for. Oh, going back in. I don't know. Do you think that default? I don't know if he's default. Like he's... Was. <laughs> I, I missed that. The, the high dragon default. Uh oh. Okay. Like, yeah, I've been waiting for Shiba to make this play. Why isn't he just SDing on repeat? Because a... I don't... Plus one's not killing him, for sure. Yeah. This is why I wanted to CC before with Kabalion, because... You hit this right here with it, close combat, it's probably over. Because there's no way the high Dragon's going to... What is he going to do? Just drop a Drake on you and die? Can you explain to me why this is not very effective? Uh, this, oh, because wait, no, because he never mind, never mind. He yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, wait, like, this, is, this is actually real bad. If he gets all oh, oh, credit, shit. well, ah, uh, shit. Okay, um, let's see how much this does. If this does over fifty, oh, actually, that did zero. Never mind. Wow, she would brought this back. That was actually really well played. Yeah. I actually can't believe that he won. Uh, where? I don't know where that game really turned around. Yeah, I'm going to go back like um, 10 turns, 20 turns. It's a lot of clicking. 
Yeah, I'm trying to look through the chat. I mean, she was getting like pretty fortunate with his uh, his rock blast rolls. He hit a four, a three, a five, and then crit him to win with a three. Didn't get a single two. Yeah, maybe. Um, I don't know how much the earthquake would have done, but maybe at plus one for the Gligar, since you're still faster, you start clicking earthquake. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I, I don't think we ever saw the plus one earthquake versus this. I wanted to see how much damage it did. Um, but he never went for it. I'm not sure. Yeah, that was... Because I don't really know what else he could have... He could have really done. I, I, I think there's, there's something when... Let's see what turn I need to be on. When it was the Cabalion in versus... Uh, oh, let's see what turn it was. Yeah, like these turns, like 76, when the, when the Beedrill had like six health. These were uh, some like dangerous 50 50. So, yeah, because yeah, uh, he, so he U turns on this turn. Because Gondra needs to get the roost off. And then Shiva makes it a uh, double back into his Beedrill. The earthquakes. He sacks the slow bro. Which I don't really mind. I yeah, so he puts he brings the cabalion in here. This is the turn I'm, I'm so eighty one. Alright, I think this is the turn I'm looking for. After so the Wait, he, right, he just sacks slow bro, yeah. Yeah, he sacks the slow bro. And then he goes for close combat, which which is a like a fair play because I don't. I mean, it hits everything, you know. Yeah. If you're hitting the prime it's enough. And then, okay, and then, yeah, Shiba had this was this was just a free. Well, yeah. Well, in these like net last twenty turns, this kind of started Shiba just forcing the Blissey and switching Rife Superior in. Like over and over for the twenty turns, and then you just you know got the roll, I guess. You know, yeah, you so I'm wondering if instead of this close combat that he goes for here, or he doesn't go for a close combat. What does he do? He goes for close combat and then he switches, right? He goes for close combat to kill the B, and then he just switches. Yeah, I I think if he instead of switching, because like so he's minus one, but. I don't think there's any way that Shiba Drake goes here because yeah if he just goes blissy then he's... yeah like I, I think you have to make this like, like you either click rocks or you click close combat yeah Shiba also doesn't know what um, blissy's last two moves are so. yeah I don't know what that I, I mean blissy. that might be toxic it's either like toxic wish protect not sure mm -hmm. like if you click so you click rocks here you click rocks here he gets the u-turn off he probably goes for his own rocks you just go directly into glagger and just like start cursing pressure this he doesn't really have a lot of switch-ins left because it when he switches in his prima then he only has two switch-ins yeah, yeah, it seemed like he he got uh, Gondra got the most mileage when he when he got his Gliger in before the Rhyperior in, right? So you get the Gliger in, you curse before the Rhyperior starts to set up, and then he he's forced to go to Prima, or like you you threaten the curse, but he actually keeps on Earthquaking, which is fine. You threaten the Prima and you get damage off, and then try to neutralize that. But the way Sheba was playing, he constantly got the Rhyperior in first. Yeah. Which I mean which meant that overall Gondra couldn't touch the primal. 
and uh, I don't know, we just kept this like cycle going and gone, and she would just one out somehow. Yeah, it was looking real. It was looking real bad for a while, but I didn't. I should have thought that the Rhyperior could would be Swords Dance. I didn't even think of that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, once that happened, it was uh, that was rough. But uh, it's only one, only one game. It's out, it's out of ten, yeah. right? Yeah, there's there's ten total. Um, four SM. One best of three of five, six, seven, and then um, six, five, four, three, and two. Gotcha. What are you? What are you playing? I am playing tomorrow night, uh, late. Uh, GSC UU. Cool. Yeah, I won't be. I'm going away this weekend, so. Yeah. But uh, post it in the Discord, and I'll, I'll watch it. Yeah, sure. we'll do. Cool. Well, I'm gonna go get back on League, where I'm uh, probably uh, have a time restriction because I left the game to come watch this. But <laughs> <laughs> that's right. It. But thanks for coming on. Um, yeah. Maybe I'll catch some more replays where we could like do replays of the other games. See. Uh, yeah. See what happens. Good luck to your team. Hope you guys win. Thank you. Yeah, me too. See you <laughs> later. See ya.